France, but he's in prison? I'm confused. So it looks like we're going to lose the Deerman dynasty over here because this guy's a bastard. Huh. Interesting. Wow, that's a lot of events. Yes, we're going to get Gardener. My garden is the apple of my eye, my pride and joy. Yes, get Gardener. And maybe we can get to secure a new alliance with this douche. You're already married. God, you're ugly. So's your wife. Duchess Alich. Oh, Octane, yeah. Uh, maybe we can arrange a marriage. Or betrothal. With our daughter? Lol. Matrilineal. Oh wait, that would mean, no, um, our daughter. There we go, matrilineal, yes. Get Dearman back on that throne. Okay, you guys are ready to roll. Let's get over here to Ostrike. You guys are good to go as well. Let's get to Pressburg. We can get there too. 10,000 troops, very good. Go to Voss. 7,000 troops, go to Zagreb. You guys moving? Yeah, you're all moving. Slowly but surely. Need to start reclaiming some territory so that we can get our score above zero. Up. Up. Uh, why don't you guys come to Varazadin? Yeah. Ah, there we go. Okay. So the queen is dead. Long live the queen. We now have a Deerman on the throne of Finland. Yes. I'm not sure if that ended that war for independence, though. Maybe not natural death. Alright, now the War for Independence is still going strong. Very good. And he hates us for some reason. Hold on. Why do you hate us? Oh, he's ambitious. Eh, okay. Well, send you a gift. 120 bucks. And let's uh, arrange your daughter to marry... Nope. your son to marry? Half-sister. Sure. No. No, you won't. Okay, whatever. Prince Arnolfo is a tough soldier. Alright. He's got some good stats, I must say. Let's go ahead and get him married off. Go help in Finland. And uh, Clorinda. Oh, she is not engaged to anyone. Let's get her married somewhere. Oops. Earl of Hamburg, Duke of Gulledge, Duke of Meath. 
Yeah, let's do the Duke of Meath. Let's do that. Matrilineal? No? There's gotta be someone that wants a matrilineal. Earl of Hamburg. Well, I don't want matrilineal. Whatever. He's the Prince of Germany. That's good. We do want to get closer ties with Germany at some point. Might as well be now. You guys go ahead and group up, and I want you to invade. You guys also group up and invade. Uh, you guys can group up in Verazden. place is falling like a stone. If it gets any lower, I'm just going to hit the assault button. We'll see. But yeah, we're finally winning this war, this crusade. That's good. Okay. Stronger ties between us and Poland. Good. Oh, we're not the leader of that siege. Damn, who is? Some douchebag, the Duchy of Albany. No, not a revolt. Fine, we'll go deal with the revolt. You keep on the siege then. They don't have a leader in this army? Wow, that's weird. Yeah, go ahead and attack it. There we go, 19,000 troops. Now we're talking. They're going to do something with that army. Alright, Voss is done. Very good. Lost 6,000 guys there. Oh, it's not done. There's one more. Alright. Okay, we're getting attacked down here. generals in here and go kill that army. People are still moving. just arrived. Cool, killed some shake. Oh, we lost our center. Damn. Oh, they're about to lose their right. Yep. trait gives us a plus two to everything. Sounds good to me. Ah, we fulfilled our ambition to improve stewardship. Holy shit. That was unexpected. Let's pick a goddamn ambition. Have a son or improve learning. Um, let's improve learning because we have a lot of piety. siege these places down as fast as possible. Done. Move on. Uh, let's take you guys and go there. And this other army can come this way.
Okay, they are retreating to Sora. Alright. Oh, we don't have any generals in that army. Lol. Now we do. More generals, please. You guys can group up and we'll send you to Seni. Yep, Pope likes us. It's good. Keep the Pope on our side, baby. Oh man, battle of this place. Senny's very weakly defended. Nice. In fact, I think we'll just assault it. Fuck waiting around. Ooh, hold on, pouring coffee. Hard to pay attention while I'm pouring coffee. I need some fake sugar, because it's delicious. And some moo juice, for the sake of moo. Alright, so who is this douchebag? Um, he's actually pretty good. Let's just kill him. Oh, and we need to chase down this army. So they're running to Rama. Then we will also run to Rama. And we should be able to just take out this place. Yep. No problem. we can drive up this war score. And they're retreating to Ysora. Alright. This place is about to fall. Fantastic. Really see any big stacks coming our way. They have like a couple thousand here and there, and that's about it. Oh, we have another army here. Holy crap. How am I not noticing these things? Alright, new army, come to Seni. Looks like we destroyed that army in Isora. Fantastic. Oh, peasant revolt again. We're about to finish the siege here. Very good.
Trace Solitude. Ah, oh, we lost Gregarious. Oh well. What are we gonna do? Okay, the Rebels are toast. Let's move on to... Eh, Senny's fine. Because this crusade is to restore the Hungarian throne, I'm pretty sure we won't get any of this land. It'll just be the Kingdom of Hungary, and they'll be our ally, which is fine. Since the Crown of Hungary is already held by a good Catholic King ruler, all gains will be handed over to him. Yep. Works for me. And Poland still has not finished the deal here with the Oglevid Emirate. Somehow. Come on, Poland. They got like nothing. How's Finland doing? Pretty good, I guess. Or not. Wow, that's a lot of battles. Or wars. Ooh, Karelia is revolting. Ooh. Count Folk's War for Finland. Ooh. Right, well. Okay, so we may not be in control of Finland for very long. Senny is done. Let's move on. We're already at 36%. Nice. This war has really turned for the better. Kind of concerned about Finland though, but I'm not not going to send any troops up there. So that would be the part released. That part, Hungary. Interesting. Alright, what happened? Ah, perfect. And this is Bar Road Blurb. It's done. Get some leaders. Siege it down. Prisoner, Prince... Oh, he's a Prince of the Solomon Sultanate. Ooh. He's complaining about his darkened cell. Ooh. Prince of the Sultanate. Is he uh, in the heir? No. 
he's not in not even one of the first three so we're just gonna murder him poor guy didn't stand a chance yep siege it down anytime it's ten to one or better just siege it down it's so quick Considered Egypt. No longer Croatia, this is now Egypt. Because it's been under their rule for fucking ever. Just like this. <laughs> That's how it works. Alright, let's go ahead and move you guys up to box, because that place actually matters. Peasants have revolted. Oh no. Whatever will we do? I know. We could go kill them. And then come back. We are at 56%. This war will not last much longer. They will just surrender. And wow, we have put in so much effort. <laughs> Our people hate us for it. They're like, why are you fighting a war where you don't get anything out of it? It's just going to go to Hungary. Typhus in Malta. Ew. How's it going, Finland? Not great. In fact, I'm pretty sure Finland's going to lose now. It doesn't look like it. But I don't really see a whole lot of Finnish troops. I see a lot of enemy troops. Those are the only Finnish troops I see. I don't see that stack of 14,000 that they had earlier. Hmm. <laughs> oh well. Hey, wife's pregnant. Sweet. Sneeze so hard there. Alright, Pressburg is done. Let's move on to Trenson. Sixty-five percent. Good good. Easels in Barcelona. Oh wow, 14,000 of them up there. 18,000, ooh, they are collecting a big stack. <sighs> Delicious coffee. As you watch some birds darting nimbly through the air, you find yourself wondering why it is that men cannot do the same. There have been unsuccessful attempts to make flying contraptions in the past, but cl clearly those designs were all conceived by fools. Building a machine that can fly will help improve your learning. Yes, I'm sure it can be done. Sounds good to me. Oh, that's right. I totally forgot we can build stuff in this game. Here I am sitting on 4,100 buckaroos, and we're not building shit. What can we build? Nothing. 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 Okay, we can't build shit. Okay, we just don't have the tech, unfortunately. What about inside? Uh, like in the city? Nothing. City, nothing. City, 
Nothing. Hmm. Well, we could help build up castle down here, but that would just be for our vassal. I'm not too interested in that. Building up the city is a little more interesting. There we go. City mode. Troll Toll booth. Hell yeah. Tax income plus four. <laughs> uh, our marshal. What happened? What happened? Don't you want to be marshal anymore? Whatever. Just put him there. Hey. I have an honorary title. I wish it would tell you why they left their post, but whatever. 74% in this war. It's almost done. Almost done. Keeping an eye on this stack over here, though. That could be a... Uh, that could be a huge problem if they actually do group together some decent armies and do something with it. Oh, is this not enemy lands? No, it's not. Oops. If they group up these two stacks into 23,000 troops, that could be a bitch to deal with. Oh, and Poland's finally down here finishing the deal. Come on, dude. Come on. Do something. And yeah, Finland's gonna lose. Oh! <laughs> in your quest to build a flying machine, you spend countless hours with dusty old tomes and parchments in an effort to learn about all the failed attempts to fly. You are finally a at the point where you feel you have learned enough to begin construction of a prototype. Fuck yeah. We're just gonna die, aren't we? Like the text is gonna say, you leap from a cliff. Like it's gonna say, you, you leap from a cliff with the highest of hopes, only to, only to notice all too late that you forgot to carry the one. Yep, they're grouping out. It's gonna be 23,000 troops there. Oh, they're fighting each other, lol. Oh, it's done. No, it's not. Oh, that was Poland. Okay, so Poland has integrated Moldova, or Moldavia, whatever it's called. So Poland's even bigger now, very cool. Okay, the prototype your flying machine is nearing completion, but it would probably be ill-advised to pilot the thing yourself on its maiden flight. Fortunately, you know several promising candid candidates who would probably be persuaded to take this historic leap of faith on your behalf. Otis, the cook, the cook's overweight son, Medrick, the local dung gatherer and dog's body, the dog belonging to the blacksmith's daughter. You press gang the dog into your service. The dog? Let's do the dog. That sounds fun. Press gang the dog. Uh-oh, we're, 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 we're wounded? What? You find a soupy steep cliff in which to launch the maiden flight and flying machine. Before you can strap the dog into the contraption, the furious blacksmith, an ogre of a man, approaches you with his crying daughter. You quickly decide to take the dog's place. What? Really? What? <laughs> we're wounded? Are you fucking kidding? You took the dog's place. Dude, just throw the dog off the cliff. It's not that hard to do. <laughs> you took the dog's place. Oh, we gained learning. As you lie in a bedchamber, bruised and battered but still alive, you can contemplate the nature of your punish plummet from the cliff. Your flying machine has been destroyed. You may never see a human soaring through the air, but this experience has taught you much about the value of science and scholarly research. Gain one learning. Cool. And Except we're wounded now. Ugh. Does not seem like a worthy trade-off. Oh well. Hurry up and end this war. This war has defined my game. Well, it's defined the last several years of this game. The peasants have revolted. Ah, stupid peasants. All my levies are already raised. You know what? You know what? Hey, go go deal with this. Um whatever. Poland has an internal war going on. Oh, wait. 
Oh, they're helping. They're helping with. They're helping Finland against Finland's rebels. Oh, cool. Well, not sure it's gonna help, but it's nice. Uh, it's nice of you to offer, I guess. Oh, 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 we have a battle. 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 Uh, let's finish this up, and we can go help. There you go. Now get your ass down in this battle. Whatever. Come on, before it's over. Come on, that's dirt. Oh yeah, their generals are not even that good anymore. Whatever. There we go. Yes. Oh, another daughter. Damn, we have a lot of daughters. It's okay. Philomena, you got it, baby. What's our main daughter? Our main daughter is Maria. Second daughter is Elisa. And then Philomena. All right. won the battle. They lost 12,000 troops. Some random douchebag was captured. Just release him. He's a random douchebag. And go to Rama. You guys can go join that army. Actually, no, go join that army. Lots of shit happening. Kill them all. Oh, we don't have a central leader. Damn. Center column, or whatever you want to call it. Oh, right, 100%. Oh, we are not the ones who can ne negotiate peace. Only the Pope can do that. Well, 100% is 100%. Should be easy. Oh, we can assassinate. Yeah! <laughs> and they're retreating to Kershavecki. Alright. But we are at 100%, so I don't think there's anything else that's going to happen. So come on then, flip over to Poland, or uh, hung, uh, Hungary, yeah, flip over to Hungary. Yes, successful crusade for Hungary, excellent. The Lord has granted King Basso of Italy victory in the crusade for Hungary against Sultan Abdul Haq I of Solomon Sultanate. Pope Nicholas III has called for a month celebration across the whole Christian world. Praise the Lord. All right, so Hungary now looks like that. Okay, so they did not get the lands that the Alamids had. Even though the Alamids were part of the war, Hungary did not get their lands. They only got the part that the Solomon had. Interesting. Can't declare war because we have a truce, right? No, we have... Yeah, we have troops in their lands. Everyone, please go home. not at peace yet. Hmm. So. Oh, no, no. Hungry. Yo. Oh, married to my kinswoman. Good for you. Your son is this fat man. Can I uh, arrange a patrol? Matrilineal. Damn straight. stand down. You can stand down. Good. Stand down. Random people are dying. Well, Hungary's back. High five, Hungary. Oh, man. 
Finland's just falling apart. Now right, you guys can stand down. Um, Prince Archbishop Camillo of Genoa claims to be a better court chaplain than Bishop Berardo. He's a 22 and he's 20. Sure. Now get your ass down to Pope. Actually, you know what? Let's convert some people. How's our relations with the Pope? 82. Yeah, let's convert some people for a change. Uh, where's the religious map? There we go. Let's convert here in Tyrol. Because they are Waldensian. Yep. Religious map's looking pretty good, though. We're doing a good job of making things Catholic. And the Lollards are almost gone entirely. Sunni and Shia are both very strong. Ooh. Yeah. That wounded trait is being a real bitch. We might die here. We have health minus one and health minus two, so we're on the verge of death. Half-brother is still doing great. Can't have any kids yet because his wife ain't old enough yet. Oh, that's right. His wife is an imbecile. One plus one is question mark. Hey, our wife's pregnant again. All right, so we, we may be... We may be wounded and ill, but we can still make the babies. Alright. What's up, France? Kinsman. You know, you are a deerman, but you're... Oh, wow. These kids are dying. You are a deerman, but... Um, not sure I want to help you. Nope. Declining would lose zero prestige. Then we then we'll decline. I don't care. Fuck you and your fucked up France. Look at that shit. Look at that fucking France. You can't hold your own shit together. You don't deserve to be on the throne. End of story. And that sucks they didn't get these provinces that weren't part of the Solomon dynasty. What do you want, Edgar Cameron? Oh, he's incapable. Lol. Yeah, we'll join your war. I don't even know what it's for, but I assume it's really stupid. Yeah, it's just a war against Munich. Not a big deal. Oh, Duchy of Meath. I thought I said Munich. Lol, it's just Meath. Huh. It's gonna be a quick war. Yep, Cameron Dynasty is now in Wales and Germany. So the Germans have been pushed out of Wales, but that's okay. Not the end of the world. Ooh, starting to think, uh... Giacinta might fancy me. Ooh, baby. Let's make a move. <laughs> I like how there's no other option. Like, nah, let's not screw that chick. The only option is make a move. <laughs> I gave her a good tumble. It's good to be the king. <laughs> Falls in love. <laughs> and we've already got three kids and one more coming from our wife, so we might as well have another baby. Baby, baby. Baby, baby. Yep, Finland is falling. It's unfortunate. Because even though we had uh, this all planned out with Fausta and everything, because when he came of age, he they rejected the matrilineal proposal. So they did get married, but not in the right way. 34% chance of assassinating him. Yeah, just try it. Yes! <laughs> uh, 
Oh, brilliant. Unfortunately, the prisoner apprehended and tortured until he babbled. Yeah, we lost some piety. And they, they may try to murder us. But we did end that war, and we kept Deerman on the throne. And I think that's important. So I'm, I'm proud of that 35% chance succeeding, getting us what we need. And hopefully they can rebuild their army and actually be a formidable, formidable ally, as they once were. Please don't murder me. My daughter is kind of crap. She's a little young to take over. Let's get betrothed to someone nice. Wow, there's nobody good who wants to get betrothed. Uh, my daughter needs a guardian. Stewardship, please. Mm, he's got some bad traits. I certainly don't want Craven. I don't really see anything good in there. Uh, let's see if we can find someone nice. Uh, search all. Uh, gender, don't care. Uh, ruler, don't care. Mary, don't care. My religion, yes. My culture, yes. In prison, no. There we go. Well... This is more well-rounded. Let's do this douche, even though he's kind of old. It's a nice way to end that war. Oh, the wound is healed. Which means we may get rid of ill at some point. Maybe we will live on. And we need to find our daughter a nice boy to marry. Since she is going to be our ruler. Unless our wife pops out a boy. I mean, she's pregnant, right? Yeah, she's pregnant. A son? Okay, we have a son. His name is Sesto. I don't think so. We're gonna call him Pesto. Fuck yeah, Pesto. So we now have a son, our new heir. And he doesn't have anything bad or good about him, but whatever. He's a son. That makes him infinitely better than the other three children we have. <laughs> it's so horrible, but it's true because primogenitor male only. Sweden has a chunk of this area somehow. And what bullshit is that? So these guys were not part of that crusade. Whatever. These guys were not part of that crusade. And all of a sudden, now they're back in the Solomon dynasty. So we could have taken them in that war, but now we can't. That's just bullshit. Well, not take them. We could have gotten them for hungry. Ugh. Vassals are going to be happy again. Can we do anything? No, we're still in that stupid war. Are you actually losing this war for me? I mean, come on. There's nothing. Oh, you're almost done. Okay, good. Hurry up. We have to give this away. We inherited it somehow. I can't transfer title to you, can I? Nope. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Betrothed can marry. Who's... Whatever. Just... whatever.
okay, we're no longer ill, so we've actually healed from that stupid flying contraption disaster. Go kill stuff. Have we converted over... Oder... Is that this place? No. That's this place, Oberbiern. Alright, well... Come on, hurry up with this fucking Waldensian bullshit. How's the Pope doing? Pope's still happy. If it drops below 50, I'm gonna send our douchebag down there to deal with him again. And we have to give away Catalogia. Let's give it to the, the bishop or whatever. Yo. And it looks like we had uh, a bastard child with our little love affair. Uh, Basso. Yeah. Name him after me. It seems my armor's adventures have resulted in a child. Little Basso's my spitting image. Legitimize him. Hell yeah. Legitimize bastard. Well. Alright, those guys are done. Go away. And yeah, that pissed off our kids. It pissed off the, our four other kids that this guy's now legitimate, but I don't care. I don't care. We have a lover. We're gonna use it. <laughs> our wife's like, fuck you. Send a gift to our wife. Give her an honorary title. Make her feel better. How's things going with your war, Poland? Not good. Man, I'm so happy we fucked up that war with Finland. Just by stabbing the guy. It's like, hey, look, we're losing the war horribly, and Finland has no more troops left. Stab. Oh, we win. <laughs> oh, it's brilliant. And I'm incredibly surprised that no one retaliated with an attempt on our life. Dude, you should totally remarry, lady. Princess. She's a princess. I mean, totally re remarry. Shit. Whatever. What are your chances in here, anyway? County converted. 15% chance every year. Eh, it's worth doing, I guess. It's worth doing. And Meath is gonna fall. Good. Slowly. Shit. Maybe we can help with that? Nah, I'm too lazy to help with that. If we had these two provinces here, we could raise a bunch of troops right here, bring them to the coast, and ferry them up. But since, since we don't have any coastal provinces over here, I'm not gonna bother. Say, fuck them. They're on their own. Denmark's got some problems. What's up, Denmark? Third Danish Civil War to lower crown authority. Oh, 84%. Damn, Denmark, you're going to lose... Lose that crown authority. Idrisid, Nasrid, Vitebsk, Turov. Whole bunch of shit out here. Crimea. Solomids, of course. They're everywhere. Alamid. Lafetid. Lafetid. I have discovered a plot where it wants to kill Prince Pesto. What? Okay, this lady, our lover, this is our lover, wants to kill Prince Pesto. Why? So that her son, the bastard Prince Basso, would take over. You know what, lady? You're going to prison. Oh, she avoided prison. No. Hmm. So now she's in Earl Buoso's court. Hmm. End your plot. Dumb bitch. Oh, 
he's dead. We don't need him anymore. Finland declared the second Finnish holy war for Twer. Really? Where's Twer? Second Finnish holy war for Twer. Down here somewhere? That's kingdom, duchies. Here we go. Twer. Ah, right here. Okay. So they want to get the Nasserid. All right, it's fine. Go for it, Finland. All right, she's dead. We don't need her anymore. Go away. Tonyoto of Finland. Very good. Oh, he wants our help. Of course we'll help. Not like you need it. And you are not that important anymore. You're sort of important. They're both in prison. They're both in prison. So much shit going on. Uh, Renault d'Afra. Good. Some douchebag in here, I guess. One of these guys, I guess. How's Pope doing? 25. Okay, you're gonna stop. You're gonna stop. We have pressing need for you to improve religious relations in Rome. The other shit can wait. Can we build anything yet with our five grand? No. No. <laughs> no. Can't build shit. Nothing. All right. What about nearby? Oh, we're not allowed to touch them. Interesting. Niederbarian converted. Good. Eh, let's improve the castles a little bit. Steve. Uh, Castle City. Get some more tax income. Castle Village. Anything for more taxes. Oh, we could build another settlement here. Let's put another city. Let's the city build. Opportunities, unfortunately. I might as well do something. It's not like we're gonna keep this money forever. Um, I think it's most unfortunate you happen to have. Nope. God, I love our conversations, don't you? Peasants have revolted. All right. Now oh, we're ill again. Damn it. Probably plenty of troops. Derp, derp, derp. Oh, yeah. 
Finland's troops, 12,000. Enemy troops, 160. And the rebels are dead. Independent Pomerania. English Holy War for Pomerania. Fuck yeah. Let me see that shit. Yeah. Pomerania has declared independence from the Holy Roman Empire. Well, not, no, no, they're not. They didn't declare independence. They're part of a war to lower crown authority in the Holy Roman Empire. And during this, during this short period of breakaway, England's like, Holy War. La 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 la. Oh, someone needs a guardian. I shall tutor you. There we go. And this is such a mess over here. Ripe for the picking. Yeah, I would not be surprised if the Ilkinet just absorbed a lot of this shit, because the Golden Horde is fucked. What's the Ilkinet doing anyway? Where's your capital? Oh, right there. And that one's over, that war. 36, just siege it down, come on. Really? Just hit the button. Come on, hit the button. Hit the button. I'll help you. I'm, I'm going to help you. I'm going to click. Hit the button. Oh, come on. Hit the button. They're really going to wait for these reinforcements. No, there they go. There they go. All right. Good, good. And that'll do. And that'll do for that war. At least it should be 100%. Nope, 48%. Come on. Oh, just hit the button. Hit the button. Come on. Ooh. Duke Sven's claim on Finland. Yeah, you better finish up that war. Oh, it's Karelia. Uh, yeah, they have some troops. Not that many, though. We're going to join that war. We can't. Oh well, whatever. Oh, 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 they just lost all this too. Novgorod. Okay, so Finland may be lost. Finland may be lost. Oh, fever's gone. We're not ill anymore. Damn, we're just back and forth with our health. But yeah, Finland... Yeah, they're toast. There's no way they can hold all this together. Smilin's revolting, Karelia's revolting, and Novgorod's revolting. Akershus is revolting, even though Akershus isn't there. It's over here. Uh, but whatever. They're, they're, they're toast for Finland. Oh, well, I think we're going to end here. Let me just stop. 9th of September, 1373. We're going to end here. We'll pick it up next time at this spot. It's been two hours of recording, so I'm going to get this converting in virtual dub. And I'll get this uploaded to you guys as soon as possible. So I hope you enjoyed this episode today. The land of Italy is still in good hands. King Basso I now has a, a legitimate bastard son. We also have a regular son, King or Prince Pesto. We have three daughters. Our wife, we've been high-fiving her quite a bit. She wants to become spy master. It's not going to happen, lady. You only have ten. My guy's got twenty-five. Not going to happen. Uh, but we've done well for ourselves. We've kept the... Uh, Muslims at bay. We even pushed them back over here. It's disappointing we didn't get all of this for Hungary, but it's a start. It's a start. And that really was the big thing that happened. We've, we've kind of let France go to the shitter, and we're also going to let Finland go to the shitter. And Poland as well? Eh, it doesn't really matter. They're not us. I don't really care if they're not us, you know? We're going to try to buddy-buddy with Germany a little bit, and maybe we'll buddy-buddy with England a little bit. Wow, all of this stuff up here is just going batshit crazy. I mean, it's just... It's silly how little cohesion there is, you know? Oh, well, as long as Lotharingia is up here sitting strong 
in Iceland, then everything is right in my world. And the Holy Roman Empire has its seat in Iceland. Oh, man. Alright, guys, this is Shen from Shenplay signing off. You all have a fantastic day, and I'll see you later.